Hello, it's Dr. Triple O Seven. In today's video, I'm doing a pretty cool video on an application called Clip Sync. This allows you to synchronize your clipboards over Wi-Fi. So the requirements for this are going to be: you have to have a Windows computer, and I'll be using a Android tablet. You can use this on an Android tablet or an Android um, smartphone. So again, Windows computer, Android tablet, or a smartphone. What we're doing is we using the application, we have to copy something on our computer and instantly paste it on our Android device. So just by clicking copy. As soon as you hit copy there, it's be able to paste here. So I'll show you guys how to set up on your computer and then how to set up on your Android device and how it works. So to set it up, just go to the website here, here which I'll have in the link below, and click set up click sync. So I'll bring it to this right here. So uh, from here, you can go like this and click this down right here. And right here is the clip sync on Google Play. We will do that after. So right here, we get this um, unknown thing. We can just run anyway. Okay, next. So what it's going to do is it's going to uh, install a mini server that's going to run. And now we'll just search. Clip Sync Server. So if you get this, you're going to hit click Allow Access. This is going to allow it to work. Make sure it's working correctly. So as you can see, we have the little application here. It tells us our IP address for our home network. And if we click this, it'll tell us how to use it. So it just kind of tells us inside here. All right. So now what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead to the Android, the, my Android tablet, and I'll continue from there. Alright, so we are back with our ta I'm on my Android tablet. Again, this works for a smartphone or tablet. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the Google Play Store and search out Clink or uh, Clip Sync. It is a free app. Um, yeah, pretty simple. And once we install it, it's going to be uh, very simple to use. So here I am just going to uh, click the install button. Sorry for the crappy quality. Um, the, I'm using webcam. This webcam isn't really made to be recording screens. I find it doesn't really record screens that well. Alright, so we are finishing up the download and it says uh, installed. So I'll be opening up now. So what? make sure you have it opened on your computer. Um, you can go ahead and open it on the icon on your, on your desktop. Get this notification saying it's open. And if you go ahead into your notification area, you can find your IP address, which is kind of useful, and you have a how-to on how to use it. So I click go ahead and connect to server. Now I found that it didn't work. So I'm not sure if this is because of my router or my internet connection or anything like that. So what I did is I just did it in the manual way. So if you want to do that, you can go ahead and do that. So basically type in the IP address that it gives you. Odds are it's gonna be 192.168.1. Dot one zero something. So just go ahead and type it in, and once you finish typing it in, give it a name. So if you're using this over different desktop computers, you can uh, give them all names. I just name is desktop PC because this is the only desktop in the house, and it's mine anyway. But anyway, so I click connect and share. It is now established a connection. You can tell because in the corner there is a green on button. If I was to tap it, it goes off. I tap it again, it goes on. Alright, so now I will uh, show you guys how it's going to work. So, um, you can just exit out of it, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a Office program. I'll be using Kingston Office. It's a free application that um, allows to write notes. So, I'm just going to open up a blank text document. All right, and from here, so now what you're going to do is you, all you have to do is find a section and click copy, right, as if you're copying it to a different program. So all I do is I have this whole program, our whole uh, paragraph, hit copy, and now I go back to my tablet, long hold, I have the option to paste. When I click paste, boom, it pastes everything I just copied from my computer. So as soon as you click copy on your computer, it instantly synchronizes with your tablet and gives you that. It also can be done the opposite. 
So uh, what I do here is uh, undo my paste. So now I'm just going to type in some random letters. And then again, long hold. I'm going to select all of it and then copy it. And you can tell when as soon as I hit copy on the tablet, I do get a notification there saying it's synchronized. So now I can go to my computer. And here I have a blank notepad. I click paste and paste it in those RAM letters that, letters that I hit. So anyways guys, that is about it for this video. I hope you guys did like the application. It is called ClipSync. I'll have the uh, link in the description below. Anyways guys, that is about it for this video. Thanks for checking it out. Happy holidays. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Stagger Triple 7, I'm signing off.